Hi Scrubs, I hope you're well. So I'm back on Horse World Online. This was quite requested um, by Fortune Cookie SSO Horse Lover 123QEWA and Noah Style. So I'm going to take another look at this. It's been ages since I've been on this. I can't even think what we did last time. So let's have a look in our starter pasture. So we still got. I've got a couple in here. Oh, okay. Um, let's have a look. So we've got Glazed Wizard, we've got Navajo Nation. Okay, that was the Fireforged Pebble Fool. And what looks to be a very, very pregnant Starlight's Diamond, Irish Diamond. So, let's view her for the moment. Um, I think she should be in full, as far as I remember. Because I think that's what we did. I think that's, uh, we had put her to be bred. I think. This mare is pregnant to Glaze Wizard. Okay, so when will my foal come? Does it actually say? It doesn't actually say. Right, well. I suppose we could age forward once we've done a little bit of stuff with her. I don't know if she can do anything at the moment. So. Let's see if we can do some cross country. You don't have enough time to enter this local show. Oh, maybe I need to go to the next day. Uh, yeah, I think I do. Okay, do you want to advance the next day? Yes, please. Okay. Right, so we've advanced to the next day. I know that there was, let's see, the player skills, right? Some of these we were working on. It looks like the only one that we can do right now is energy saver, so let's begin that course. Okay, so that is in progress. So I don't think there's anything we can do in there. Nope. Right, it says mow 20% down here. Okay, so mow mowing a pasture will reduce the grass quality, which is helpful for your horse's overweight. You'll also earn some money by selling the hay. Mowing a pasture takes time from your day. Now let's mow it. Let's see. Okay. So we've mowed and we've sold some cut hay for 272. Okay, well let's visit the area again. And we'll work with some of these horses because... I know that I want to sort of get a little bit further with them. Alright, I'm going to put this one into hills. I'll we'll put it for... No, okay, that's too long. 20 minutes? 10 minutes? Okay, we can do 10 minutes. Alright, okay, so we've got some experience points from doing that. And I think we're alright time-wise, but the horse doesn't really have much in the way of energy left, so we'll not do anything more with that one. Okay, this is slightly worrying. It's not even enough feed for energy. Oh, okay. That's probably because I'm I mowed the grass and the pasture. That was probably a really bad idea on my part. Maybe we should get another pasture, possibly. Can we buy another pasture? Looking at all these pastures, I'm very aware that I don't think I really have enough to be buying these. Um, I guess we'll have to do something else with this. There's some I could buy, but I think maybe we should just sell some of the horses. Right, we'll sell our pebble horse, so post sale ad. Okay, so we've never sold any of our horses before. I have no idea what this horse is worth, but I'm just gonna try. Okay. There we go, so it's been posted for sale. I don't know if that is going to, to sell at all. I have no idea. Okay. My horses still aren't eating enough for Fireforge Pebble isn't in Starlight to Irish Diamond. Maybe I need to adjust the feeding here. Right. Or could it be that this is what I require to, you know, to give to the horse and it's not getting it? Let's have a look at the other ones. The other ones have that as well. There's only two of them were complaining. Uh, yellow corn, uh, oats maybe. Sweet feed, performance mix, weight gain mix, alpha alpha hay, uh, try 5%. Not exactly understanding this yet. I'm assuming that the blue is what's recommended, but I don't see a way that seems to be doing that unless. Let's try 40%. Uh, yellow corn, oats. That looks a little bit better. So this is given one, 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 one. Hmm. Let's try. Maybe we'll bring it down a little bit. Thirty-five 
percent. 106, right. Let's just have a look at them. Okay. So it's not getting all of its daily energy, I'm guessing, because these other ones are sort of there. Right, let's add that up to 15%. Okay, that's 101 now. This is not sufficient here, so if we up that a bit. Okay. They're all above it now, except for my full, which is going to need a little bit more, I think. Um, right, okay. This now should allow them to do everything they need to do. Right, we've done some training with all of those now. Okay, I can't do any more with that. I'm going to age forward to the next day. Okay, well none of the horses seem to have complained this time around, so that must mean that they're all getting enough to eat, which is good. I mean, I'm guessing the blue line is kind of what would be ideal, but they're maybe just not getting that. That's maybe what they recommend it is, but I'm not really seeing anything there. This one's moderately fleshy. This is a description. This one's moderate. Moderate. Moderately thin. Okay, well this one is my foal. So we need to we need to up whatever the foal's eating right now. Maybe some weight gain mix would be good for it. We'll see if that makes an improvement eventually. So we'll do a wee bit more training with this one. And all of these ones as well. Okay, it's a new day. My foal is still moderately thin. So I think I'm going to up this even more to try and improve it. We'll do some more training with it. And then we'll age it. Okay, we've got it back to moderate, so that's good. That means we're sort of on track now with it. Okay, so I'm out of turns. I can't age my I can't age forward anymore. It won't let me. I have to wait. So no no fall out of this yet, but at least we've sort of worked out the feeding a little bit. Um, I feel like the blue must indicate the recommended amount of each thing, so the recommended amount of protein and fiber and sugar. Right now they're just getting a lot of fiber and very little of anything else. So maybe I need to play around with that a little bit more, I'm guessing. I mean, let's see what here we have. We have a lot more information about it. Wow, there's so much information there. I'm not going to get into that right now, but yeah, that would help quite a bit. And you've got, there's information there on what each actually does and the cost as well. Okay, so if my horse is underweight or, or overweight, if a horse is fed more than 100% of what he needs, he'll gain weight. And if he's fed less than 100% he'll lose weight. Reduce the amount of hair grain fed. Move the horses into a barn. So not eating the extra grass. Mow the grass in the past just as less grass for the horse to eat. So I guess that kind of gives a general overview. Anyway, I'm going to leave it there, guys. Uh, thank you to Fortune Cookie SSO, to Horse Lover 123GWE, and to Noah Stealth for the video. I hope you had a lovely day, Scrubs, and bye, guys!